Family Values is appointed by Governor Rick Perry to Texas, from Texas to the Texas Department of Criminal Justice. He was at the Morehouse College into the Hall of Preachers, appointed to the Hall of Preachers for his several books that he's wrote in his life's work, over 18 books. So one of the first preachers, or if the first preacher to have a weekly TV program, a down-to-earth minister that speaks the truth and honesty. He's planted over 19 churches just in the Houston area. When Martin Luther King came to Washington to, to give the speech, I had, I had a dream speech. He said to my right, listen to this great man. At the corner of the reflecting pool, and listen to a great man of honor, wanting to see all people, black, white, red, yellow, whatever color, to come to know God could come to know unity. People, when we, have, when we work together in unity, we can move as a unit. And we'll be in unity. That is the covenant. Many times we have misunderstandings of the covenant. We have to be the covenant warriors in Christ. generation pastor, they are warriors. My father in World War II, over five major battles, Africa, Germany, European wars. My brother in Vietnam, warriors. So I'm proud. Menzo d'Italia, America. In other words, America, you're like a river that gives us life. And without you, we cannot exist. And that is the reason we're here today to honor such a man as Pastor C.L. Jackson, a great brother in Christ. I have a dream also that all men, black, white, Yellow, whatever color, that the red man, the Native American people will come to give honor, to come out of the woods, to come out of the reservations, over 365 tribes, to come out of those reservations and become, to give honor to God, where honor is due. That is my Would you give the Lord a hand of praise? Thank you. 
years ago, right over here beyond the fence, I stood as a young man who was led here by God and Martin Luther King. To Washington, the first trip on a bus to go through Mississippi, which they nagged us to come because they promised us they would blow the bus up. And we came and served, and I was in the sermon, Dr. Martin Luther King preach. I have a dream. Well, let me say this, and I get out of your hair. 